In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Hi, everyone. I am Brother Francis. I would like to tell you today the story of a great saint known by the name the Apostle of Rome. Can you guess who it would be? It's Saint Vincent Pallotti. The late 1700s was a time of unrest for the whole of Europe, especially with the influence of French Revolution and the like. It was then on the 21st of April 1795 little Vincent was born to Peter Paul Pallotti and Maria Magdalena. Vincent showed extraordinary signs of holiness and charity from his very early days. He was so compassionate to the poor and the disadvantaged. He often returned home barefoot or with nothing to keep him from the extreme cold, for he would have given it all to the poor. As a priest he spent the day visiting the sick and the prisoners. He spent a major part of night in prayer and mortification. He used to spend long hours in the confessional, showing to all the merciful love of God. Vincent was so devoted to the Holy Eucharist, that as eyewitnesses say he often fell into an ecstasy, or was seen sometimes elevated in the air. On January 9, 1935, while he was at Thanksgiving after the Holy Eucharist he was inspired to found the Union of the Catholic Apostolate. Vincent Pallotti invited people of all walks to join the Church in reviving faith and rekindling charity. The Union included clergy, religious and the laity. St. Vincent Pallotti died on the 22nd of January, 1850. He was canonized in 1963. St. Vincent Pallotti is true model for all who wish to grow in holiness. His life and mission had saved many, and have made the church more beautiful. be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen.